All right, so this project has finally come to the point where we are ready to put it in the water. Um, it's been a long, long uh, project, about seven years. Uh, not all of that's been work. Some of it's just been dreaming, but um, now's the time to see if it was worthwhile. And pretty much got it mechanically done. This is a scratch-built vehicle. This is all aluminum formed tubing. And some of the mechanical components like the axle and the engine and transmission were salvaged from another car. It's basically front wheel drive, twin rear propellers, and right now it's configured to steer with the front wheels. There's some debate whether that's gonna work or not. I think it's gonna work. Um, some people say otherwise, but uh, we'll try it today. Uh, we're gonna settle that once and for all. Okay, so internally here, uh, the layout of the engine is rear engine, transmission is pointing forward, which is unusual for car layout, but it works in this situation. Anyways, this engine produces about 100 horsepower, give or take. Um, it's you know not the most high-powered engine, but it's lightweight. It's aluminum block, aluminum cylinder head. Uh, transmission's a tough little 4x4 transmission, and the transfer case was modified from the same layout. Um, See rear exit exhaust. All right, so in the back here, uh, we have a single uh, swing arm, one rear wheel. Did this whole piece custom, and the, the hub is sort of modified with the spindle from the front. Twin propellers, uh, these will go up and down approximately eight to nine inches. Uh, so if we go down with them right now, they'll hit the ground. We have the radiator up front here. It uh, it scoops air in from in here, the lower part, and it basically just curls up so the air comes in and comes right out these vents here up the top. And there's an electric fan on there if we needed it. In the front here, we don't, uh, okay. Just have some temporary cushions and stuff to sit on because it's, at some point I'll get this upholstered with a nice tucked cushion. But for now, we're just using this. Super simple controls, you got three pedals couple levers for your uh, gears. Really, really bare bones in here right now. Okay, great.
Don't fly too high Be sure to keep the ground in sight Fly forever if you keep it tight Love the world and keep the sky on your mind So the plastic things broke, so the fan tipped down. We got it patched back up. I think we're gonna head back.